if you want something, you've got to go get it. Nobody's going to give you anything. You got to have to work hard. The hurdles, uh, first of all, I'm thankful that they exist because if there wasn't hurdles in track and field, I'd definitely be circulating my resume for sure. David Oliver to victory. The hurdles, it is a metaphor for life. I mean, every time you negotiate one, another one pops up. We all face them in life. And you know, it's whoever's gonna negotiate the barriers the best is the one that's always successful at the end of the day. In this first heat of the hurdles is David Oliver. I graduated from school, moved to Florida to chase after this dream, and I was working eight hours and you know, going to practice after that. Oliver takes the lead. Oliver wins, paying second. David Oliver into the finals. Just building my, my status up, you know, year by year, just trying to climb the ranks. He said he was so broke, he used to survive on rice and pancake mix back in 05 and 06. I just stayed focused, stayed on task, and I knew that if I put all the effort into it that I was going to be rewarded, and that's exactly what happened. Oliver and Trammell at the line. Oliver with a lean to beat Terrence Trammell. He books his ticket onto this Beijing team. A great race right there. 2008, the Olympics, it was uh, just amazing. I went there to take care of business and win a medal, but it was definitely a, a daunting task. You have 80 plus thousand people watching your every move day after day after day. It was just surreal. Last hurdle, Roadblaze over it and wins with Payne second and Oliver third. David Oliver with an amazing performance for the first time on a big stage like this. Coming from a relative nobody and to medal on the, the biggest stage in the sport, it's indescribable, like the feeling that, that I had. But it's something I strive for, worked hard for, and uh, made the dream come true. Four years, it's flown by pretty fast. Things have changed. I've progressed up the ladder, set American records in the event, and been one of the, the fastest guys since Beijing. David Oliver, 12 18. Whoa! David Oliver almost breaking the world record. I think all the things that I've done, the successes that I've reached, that I believe anybody can do it. You just gotta stick with it and work hard. Now, going into 2012, I definitely want to uh, upgrade that bronze medal.